So this is what happens if you're going to try to be a snowbird and you wait too long to head south. Sorry about the shaky camera, but I'm pretty cold. And no, I'm not dressed for this kind of weather. But I was just going to come out here and brush the snow off the panels so that uh, my batteries can get some solar charge today. And I pulled the ladder out, climbed up there. There wasn't much snow, just a little bit. I've got one, com one panel completely in the shade. And they're all three covered with about a quarter inch of ice. There is no snow on them anymore. I brushed it all off. So I came inside the camper real quick here to see if I'm getting a charge. I don't know if you can, hopefully the light's decent enough. You can see that. But the trimetric is showing that it is charging. And this orange light down here on the charge controller shows that it's charging. So let's see what we got. Oh, by the way, it's uh, minus 10 with a wind chill factor of minus 25 right now here in Iowa. 15.7. So I know that seems high, but that's compensating for the temperature. And they're definitely getting a charge. 1.2 amps, which is not much they're at 99 percent and the temperature let's see what the temperature of the batteries are here let me scroll through here 21 watts and the temperature in celsius that's my battery temperature in celsius Minus 16. So that's pretty darn cold. I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll see once we head south here in about a week. We'll see if the batteries are going to be damaged from that. Probably not with the uh, amount of charge that they're, they have. Right now here we're showing 15.8 on the... Uh, voltage that's a 12 volt battery bank but minus 16 degrees so hopefully that thing's doing the math right and making the right calculations as to how much power it's giving those batteries just trying to keep them from freezing Whew, i'm going back in it's cold